All right, take two. I had the trifecta just happen in a recording where I had two extremely shitty quality photos followed up by that bug out where it doesn't load in the next picture. And I said, that's enough torture for one video. Unfortunately, I started again just because things went so badly. All right. Last time I had one of these, I was... We're moving... I mean, I can keep going forward, but nothing's changing. So, this is going to be another one of these. Last time I picked, it was like over here. So, I'm just going to click. Here. And I'm not going to bother wasting any time. Oh, I got lucky with Vietnam. Apparently, we're in... Uh, this is 100% luck. Near Kudu... Leech Boo Long. I'm not. I Location, I'll give you points. Those points aren't for me. That was 1,000 and a million percent just me guessing. That was not obvious at any point. Just be going off that last photo where the fucking guy was in a kayak. Give me. Okay. This is not the U.S. This is potentially a Scandinavia. It's not Canada either. I don't think this is Russia. This is definitely potentially Arctic Circle. Uh, wait, the tree line ends before the Arctic Circle, right? Or is it? I think it's the other way around. Regardless, we're up here. One of the two. Uh, I've already forgot what the hell I talked about because I had to restart things. Oh god, that guy, he told me things. To, like do a Venn diagram of if these symbols it means these countries but I don't remember off the top of my head because my memory is shot so we uh, continue on but I think I have the right region of the world at least whether or not it's the right country is hopefully to be determined here shortly but I I don't know Keep clicking on. That's just a parking sign. Yep. Yeah, that tells me nothing. I wonder what it's like driving through here at night. Or parking right over there. There's no lights here. You probably see really nice night sky out here. One of the things you don't see when you live in the city is just how much stuff you can see in the night sky excuse me oh and you're out in the woods okay this may help this has potential now we do have a highway or a route 70 all right we're gonna camp here for the rest of the time and try to find Okay, it's a blue seven D. These are not blue. Are you blue? Now I remember last time I did one of these things that that language also could be over here. B twenty four. A three. Okay, it's not that one. Let's try down here. Oh, I, hmm, I don't think it's that. I'm 40% certain. I'm just trying to match the color of the root, and I'm not, I'm not seeing it. What is this tiny, tiny island? Iron hold. Here we go. I think we're here in this country of Sweden. Yes, I believe this is it. Now I just have to find 70, which could be difficult. 73, I'll click here just because I found 70. Got it. All right, how long is 70? Yo, 70 is pretty long. I'm looking for any of these. Any of these places on this road. 
Okay, it does switch. Oh, that's all the time we have. Oh, it's right near the border. Okay. Give it stars for the location again. Um, England. I'm going to say England. This is not England. Maybe it is. I don't know. <clears throat> that was still kind of a nondescript town name. Okay, now we're we're definitely not there now. Ebers Rupp? I don't know what this is. Bissen Yerg Tulu Fresh. Ah man. That's Assens. Is this Denmark. I'm going to guess Denmark. I'm just kind of like honing down just because I don't know. I'm not seeing those weird O things. They do the little circle above the A. That's what that thing is. I'm guessing. I mean, I really. I don't know. I could be very, very much off on this. I'm going to click there for now. Anyway, as the time I'm recording this, um, not all of E3 has happened. I mean, when this comes out on Monday, still not all of E3 has happened. The only one that's happened so far is just the Electronic Arts one. And if you don't know what E3 is, it's the Electronic Entertainment Exposition. It happens every year in June. Ooh, we got a, we got a fire here, huh? Can I get anything from this? It's, this is an inch, like, interesting that you actually have fire, which seems to be a temporary thing happening here. I'm in... The let man wait. It says DK. Does it mean it's Denmark? I mean, you can sometimes tell from what country Politi. I don't know what country that is. I know it's not Italy. I know it's not France. It's not Germany. Don't know what other country it could be. I think it's... I think I have it in Denmark. Yep. Lopa Harkid. So I have... I'm gonna... Hmm. How close do I have to get? No, that doesn't, that doesn't help. I think I've got the country. It's just a matter of... If I've got the right section of the country. And I don't know if I do. I'm gonna like... I'm just going to play that around the middle of the thing here, but it's a cute, cute, tiny house. But anyway, E3 is happening, and EA is the only one that's happened so far. And I don't, like, so much get insanely excited every time I watch the E3 stuff, because it's the way that the companies want their games to be shown. Not, like, a very, like, critical or subjective way to look at things when they get released. It's just... Three and a half hours of trailers, basically. I mean, I'm not, I'm not telling you anything you probably already don't know. Incendero? This is fucking... Nothingsville here. You gotta mo make a better lawn here. You got these McMansions with nothing around them. This giant blocked off area that... Yeah, fuck your trash. But I don't I don't sit there and say number one game's garbage when I see it for the first time either because fucking thing's not out. Don't be so hyperbolic when you first see something. Just be like, okay, go into it with a with a sense of interest. Don't be like one hundred percent dismiss a thing unless you're like, Well, I don't find this type of game interesting. You can do that's totally fine. 
but just to be like, oh god, this game's garbage, just look at it, I hate it, this is awful, what were they thinking, type shit. Is this guy's name Huge Jasso? No, it's Homer Jasso. Just as good. Trevino. I mean, if you, like, the Death Stranding thing. I mean, at this point, it's just kind of a... This is really sad. To me, this this whole, like, layout of what this potentially will, will become is they have these fenced off areas and then you buy these houses and you further fence off the areas. It's like putting up these things for display when no one gives a shit. Like this is the middle of nowhere and we're putting up all these big fancy fencing. We're like, this potentially can be yours. Just never mind the shitty ass dry-ass dirt sand yards with very poor mowing on it. Where the hell is the end of this thing? Number one. Like, this. look at this amazing giant-ass field this guy has for yard. It's fucking shit. Granted, this is how all... I don't know how to get out of this thing. I need to get out of this thing. Like, I'm not interested or well I'm, i don't care about kojima stuff like death stranding that's the that's gonna be the interesting thing that they'll probably show off i just did a big fucking circle get me out of here this way i'm, I'm stuck in suburbia here plan suburbia sendero trails so it looks like frails well, we're back on some road, and I don't think it matters what way I go. I'm not going to find anything. I'm just saying this is Texas. I just don't know where. Like, I think one of the things that may potentially have made the Kojima stuff, no matter how famous it is, is maybe he was from, from constraints and being reined in. I mean, we'll see when this thing comes out. It's going to be what it is. It's probably this obtuse art project, which some people are interested in. I'm just looking at it as like this dartboard of bad shit, crazy concepts and ideas. I'm sure he may have thought about making this thing forever, and now he's happy he gets to do his magnum opus. This is a historical marker. Where am I? I'd be, that'd be nice to have one of those as a marker. Oh, we were down there. Well, at least I got the state right. No points for how depressing. Well, hello, Russia. My old friend. I'm not going to know where the hell we are. I'm, I'm probably not going to get the 3,000 points necessary to get our goal that we like to get every time we play this game. I've resigned myself. There is a sign up here, though. That's going to tell me two places I can't pronounce. Brzeki? Brzeki? And, no, it's Yazniki. V-Y-A-E-N-I-K-I. Vianiki? Vlad? Vladimir? Vladimir? It's B L A D I M I R. What the fuck's Vladimir? Get me on the road. Alright, Vladimir, think. We're gonna we're gonna talk this through. Anyway, E3 real quick, just go into it with a reserved mind, think. Okay, this is interesting, but just don't dive in. It's okay to get excited. Just know that these things are made with the sole intent of getting you excited. There's sometimes very little they tell you, and they're never going to tell you bad things. You're just going to have to find that out later. I'm going to say, I don't know what... Vladimir. Oh, this is a big enough city. I'm going to click here. Hopefully, I'll find what city this is. Give me a highway marker. That'd be great. 
an intersection at some point we're going to get to. And we're, there's no signage here. Btrans.ru, but that doesn't help me anything. This is a giant fucking country. Vladimir. There's Vladivostok, but that's not Vladimir. Hmm. This is a huge highway with a lot of houses. It makes me feel like this is one of the larger cities, because this is a long strip of road, and there has always been... No, we were... C-H-Y-D-N-O-V-O. Chudyanovo? Chudyanovo. My, my pronunciation. Fucking childish. It's annoying. I wish I was able to conjugate these things way better. I mean, that says stop. S-D-O-P. Can't make anything else out. I'm just going to head back into potentially what is town. I'm hoping for potential signage, but I'm not seeing it. And I'm really getting annoyed with this crisscrossing zigzag. M C T E R A M S This Ugh. Fucking learn how to say words, god damn it. Oh, it's Vyazniki. Vyazniki. Actually, I got a lot closer to Moscow than I thought. They gave me more points for that than I thought I was going to get. I'll give it four stars, whatever. 2136. I did not deserve this one. That one was fucking guess of all guesses, but that's how this game works. It's. Mostly for me, it's how this game works. I'm going to get fortunate and uh, get a guess, or I won't, and we'll have a round like we had not too long ago. But uh, hey, thank you all for watching. If you could like, favorite, comment, comment, subscribe, tell your friends, tell me any tips. All of it is always greatly appreciated. But until next time, folks, have a good one. Stay safe. I don't know. I don't know why I feel I need to give words of wisdom. I'm just a voice in the internet. We'll see you later.